awesome. Welcome back to my kitchen. I see that you guys enjoyed my pop-in cooking video yesterday, the mini burgers. So today I thought that I was gonna get this. This is actually candy today. I'm pretty sure it's candy. I'm not sure, I'm kind of confused. There's like a toilet here. There's like a French flag. There's an Eiffel Tower. There's different versions apparently or something like that. Um, I don't know what's going on, but it, I like toilets. I, I visit them regularly. So I was like, you know what? Toilets, DIYs, let's do this. I'm excited for this whole first few weeks. I might just be doing these Japanese DIYs because they're so much fun and I have no clue what I'm doing. Like I know, like, I guess I never really know what I'm doing, but I, I really have no idea what I'm doing when I'm doing these DIYs. So toilet fun time. Also, if you're interested in buying this DIY today, you can find it in the link on Amazon below. It's really cheap. It's like $4 if you want it, if you want to make it at home. I don't know what you want to do. If you guys get this video to 30,000 likes, I'll prank Roy's toilet with something weird. Like, I don't know what I'm going to put in it, but 30,000 likes, you got that video. So. It's up to you guys. And if you guys are new, I post a video every single day at 12 p.m. If you want to become a Marmar, all you have to do is subscribe. Come hang out with us. I just literally hang out in my kitchen. I post DIYs and gaming and I do cool things with my coven. And let's jump right into this toilet DIY. Ah! All right, so this is what it looks like. It is very beautiful. Nice little box that. Oh, is it a surprise every time? Like, you don't know which box you're gonna... Oh, I think I got the New York one. So it's very fitting, because I'm a... Mer I thought it was... This whole time, for some reason, I thought I was gonna get the white one, but I guess it's random every time. Does it say which one you're getting? It might... That might be the color. I'm not entirely sure, but... Anyways, let's just continue with the DIY Dizzle. So we have, I think these are flavorings. Um, Moco Moco Mocolet. Moco Moco Mocolet. Also, and this also says Moco Moco Mocolet. Ooh, and decorations. Wow, cool. Um, I'm excited. Actually, this is awesome because blue is my favorite color. So let's go ahead. Oh, 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 okay. So the pieces come like in these little like pop outable things. So you can just like simply pop it out like bam, bam. I've never built a toilet before. This is exciting. Like how does the Japanese come up with this, man? They're so creative. Like I gotta go meet some more Japanese people to help me with my DIYs because they are like beyond creative. I like this a lot. I think this is the head part of it. What is this? What is this head part? out all right so we have the base of the toilet what looks like it i'm gonna just put the base in here hopefully i'm doing this correctly um i'm gonna stick the top piece in yes this is actually a pretty simple build all right i thought it was gonna be a lot harder than this and now i i think i built my toilet wait wow that, who who knew it would be this easy to build a fully functional Working toilet, amazing. What? Put some eyes on this toilet. Oh my gosh. It's like they, knew, how did they know I'm like American? All right, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put the eyes where they're supposed to be. Got one eye right here. Put you right there, Mr. Eyeball. Bam, one eye. Eyeball number two. Placing eyeball number two right there. Little winky eye. And then, uh, you know, everyone looks so weird without eyebrows for some reason. Like we're so used to seeing eyebrows that we have to just see it even on our toilets. So I'm gonna put my eyebrows there and I'm gonna take my other eyebrow right here and place it oh no did I drop it oh no okay I thought I lost it for a second here we go my other eyebrow right there so it's kind of like uh-huh like you know he's like winking and there's like uh-huh then I'm gonna put a cheeseburger right on the toilet bam right in the middle you know after you eat cheeseburgers this is where you go take my little American flag right here I'm gonna put it right here so you know this toilet was made in America awesome possum okay so I read the instructions kind of like it says like dump some stuff in there and then your toilet will fizz i think i kind of want this to come off though so you guys can see what happens when i dump the water in is it permanently oh oh that's not good i hope i didn't break it uh oh and nope actually it is still intact the japanese make some very quality high quality products so my scissors i'm gonna cut this part off on the top pour it right in yes Ooh, as you can see, it's like going into the bottom of the toilet right there. Wow. It smells really, really good. I don't know. It's like fruity or powdery, but it says to fill up the top of this with water. So I'm going to do that. And I guess I'm just going to dump it. Whoa. 
Whoa, the toilet is filling up. Guys, what else is supposed to happen? Is anything else supposed to happen? Am I supposed to get the straw? I'm gonna get the straw right here. Okay, let's mix it. Mixing it around. Oh, there's some stuck in there. Oh, oh, the toilet is fizzing. Oh boy, am I supposed to add more water? How many cups of water? Oh gosh, the toilet is still fizzing. It's fizzing. Oh boy, whatever. Oh, what did you eat? Oh no. Oh, it's fizzing a lot. Oh my goodness. There's a lot of fizz. That is, that is some fizzy toilet. What? That is so interesting. What is in there? Alka-Seltzer? Is that you, Alka-Seltzer? Fizzing up a storm in here. It's foaming at the mouth. And, uh, uh, cinematic shots, go! Okay, I'm getting on the DIY table for now. I'm gonna have some tasting furniture later, but for now, I just have the tasting table, I guess. This is the tasting table where we try things out, also known as my kitchen counter. Here it is, the fully functional toilet with lots of bubbles in it. It actually smells like Marmar's when I made the Ramoon, Ramune popsicle. It smells like Ramune to me. Look at this. There's so many bubbles in here. I'm kind of very excited to try this. You guys ever had a dream of making your own toilet and then drinking out of it like a puppy? Well, here it is. It's happened. Today, your dreams are have come true. You can order it down there in the Amazon link below. Let's check this out. Okay, here we go, guys. I'm going to try this out right now. See how this tastes. That's, woo! Ah! I'm not used to it. Oh, what is that? <laughs> I don't think I like it. It's a very interesting taste. I wouldn't say, I wouldn't, I don't even know what I just tasted. I drank it all though, but like, there's like no more in there. <laughs> there's some foam in there, but like, I'm, I can't stop drinking it even though, like I don't like it, but I can't stop drinking it. Does that make sense? I don't, it's like such a weird, interesting taste that I can't stop. Mmm, I don't know, it's like, it's growing on me. How about that? It's, it's growing on me. I kinda like it, I'm not sure if I like it. I don't know what is in my mouth right now. Here is the blue one. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut that open right there. Best blue one. Mm. Okay, here we go. We got my lid full of water. It's just foaming up in the top part. No, go in, blue one. The blue one. Oh gosh, it's just foaming all the way up. Oh, there we go. I think I unlocked the hole, maybe? I'm just gonna drink out of the top of the tower instead of the actual bowl itself because it doesn't want to cooperate and go inside the bowl. So cheers, let's try the top one, the blue one. Here we go. Wait, I don't know if I... <coughs> Ew! Okay. So you know how there's like stuff that was stuck at the bottom? I got it like concentrated, like slurp. Like I slurped like concentrated powder into my mouth. <laughs> but here's some more foam. I'm gonna try some more of it. I mean, I feel like... We try to make it taste like if soap were a candy, like they're like, yo, what if we made like foamy soap candy? So like, that's kind of like what it is. It's like, they're like, you know, how can we make something kind of soapy? Like it reminds me of soap. When I eat it, it kind of reminds me of soap, but I know it's not soap, I know it's candy, but, but a lot more candy E. Does that make sense? That's what I get when I eat this, but these toilets are really cool. Like I want to collect more of them. Like if you look on the side of the box, people like actually grow plants out of the toilet. They use them as toothpick holders. I want to say thank you guys so much to all my marmars out there watching this video right now. Thank you for watching me DIY this little toilet seat right here and watching me at 12 p.m. every single day. Even if you didn't watch me at 12 p.m., you got to know that I post the video every single day at 12 p.m. Thank you so much for subscribing. And remember, if you get this video to 30, thousand likes I'll put something weird in Roy's toilet like a toilet prank of some sorts I don't know what it is yet but I'm sure I'll think of it I know you guys can do it I believe in you thank you guys so much again for watching this video and being a marmar a beautiful marmar I will see you guys tomorrow at 12 p.m. for another new video peace
my beautiful marmars and welcome to my kitchen and today's video is gonna be a little bit different weird I don't know so you might have seen these on YouTube before um, but I was actually in little Tokyo recently with Roy my friends and I saw this kit and I was like what mini burgers and mini fries I gotta do this as a DIY so today is a DIY Japanese candy I think this is candy I 